Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, thrill seeks of all ages. My name is Coaster Chow, Dogster Ball, but built for theme parks. And welcome to a very, very exciting theme park newsroom update where some trademarks have come out from Mac company the mac family mac rides are uh, about uh possibly the europa park coaster project for 2023 what could be still 2023 now obviously i'm a really big fan of this i'm a really big fan of this and i've got no mist i've got every kind of mystery as to what this coaster is going to be but i've got no mystery that this is going to be a wonderful world-class attraction but the thing that's sort of striking me about this is what area they're going to go for, what names they're going to go for. Well, we've possibly got the answers. Now, before we go through all the information in this video, please like the video, comment down below your thoughts and opinions, subscribe and click the OK bell so you never miss the YouTube video. We are getting closer and closer to 2,300 subs. Um, I'm, we're on the road as well. We're on track to hit a million views of 4K subs by the end of this year. So please keep subscribing and make this happen. Also, guys, check the description down below for Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, Snapchat, and Discord links for the channel. And also the Google Forms link where you can submit your video ideas and content suggestions. And for now, guys, let's have a look at the trademarks for possibly the new coaster project at Europa Park. So there are three different names adventure park europa apparatus ohm or ohm and trans transferator ohm so apparatus ohm and transpirator ohm so this the, the last two are sending, are, are sending people into speculation overdrive as there could be potential links to the 2023 coaster project now first of all let me talk about the adventure park europa and i'll talk about that in a bit more detail afterwards as well I think Adventure Park Europa could potentially be a second gate park name, but we don't know this yet. Um, but basically, the park have been releasing books recently, which tie into the storytelling worlds they're creating. There's been two based on Rulantica, the water park, and currently there's a series based on the Adventure Club of Europe. So it's their version of Disney Sea, for those of you who need a bit of information. This fictional organisation ties together the stories of the new rides in the park, Voltarium, Madame Fruinch, New Pirate in Batavia, and Rulantica, and the basis for future projects and rethemes. Now, the Ace Book series described on their website as based on current and future attractions in the park. Now, the third book, released in autumn this year, is a synopsis teasing it will be set in Croatia and features a phantom of the underworld that's set to live in the catacombs under the Zagreb Theatre. Now, the four Ace Scouts, when in the underworld, also come across an apparatus built by Nikola Tesla, who was from Croatia. Now, this has all created quite a speculation bugs buzz amongst the Europa Park fan base. Alongside Romania, Croatia is also often known as one of the rumoured countries for the new themed area uh, that Michael Mack has been keen on um, to build as part of this new coaster. We've heard loads of different whispers about what the coaster could be. Could it be an extreme spinning coaster? Could it take elements of that? What's the themed area? We know where it's going to be. It's going to be where Traumatica, the Halloween event, currently is now. That's going to get relocated to somewhere else and expanded to make a bigger Halloween event. And the current Traumatica area will be the land, the new land set to be Croatia from the from the ties and the links uh, with the brand new roller coaster involved. Uh, now the mentions of catacombs brings to mind another rumour about the new area over the years and that's Traumatica's mazes will be permanently housed in the area's basement level. And last but not least the area's main attraction is the new coaster and there's been rumours it will actually be a duelling coaster. Now Michael Mack's remark a few years ago posted earlier uh, in different threads online so you can go check them out for yourself about the ride featuring a couple uh, kilometers of track have only added to the speculation. The dual ohm names of Apparatus and Transferator are they potential names for dueling coasters? Who knows? It might all be crazy coincidences. Maybe some other Tesla electricity themed attractions will be in whatever adventure park. However, we could see Croatia come to Europa Park as a new area and Apparatus and Transferator are the long awaited new Mac coasters. Hopefully we'll be finding out more very, very soon, and if 2023 is still on the cards, we'll see construction begin as soon as possible. So overall, this is very, very exciting, and I'm going to talk about my thoughts on the names of the Europa Park coasters right about now. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen, Thrill Seeks of All Ages. That is talking about potential links and speculation from trademarks to Max... Uh, 
coaster 2023 project at Europa Park. Now, this puts everything into perspective for me because from this I could definitely see Croatia as the brand new land for 2023 at Europa Park in Rus, Germany. Now we don't know for sure it's 2023 because of course with the latest shutdown in Germany because of coronavirus aka COVID-19, uh, we don't know if the project's been delayed again. So if it is still 2023, some point around the summer this year I bet. Uh, well, in the next couple of months, we'll start to see some construction beginning on the new uh, roller coaster and the new land to go with it. Now, if it's been delayed by a year, I could see end of 2021 the construction begin. Not quite 2022, but end of 2021. Uh, so, I think we're looking at 2023 or 2024 perhaps, but I think 2023 is still on the cards in my opinion. I don't think that's going to block anything off. In, if anything, it's going to make them work quicker because, you know, there'll be no crowds to watch in the park, so there's less distractions, I guess. Uh, but obviously, the works have got to be on site and, you know, is it a safe environment coronavirus-wise and things like that. So, you know, there's, there's things to put that into doubt. Uh, but I'm, in my opinion, 2023 is still on the cards for this brand new roller car. Costa, uh, apparator ohm and transferator ohm I, I, I don't know about the names I'm not I'm gonna be completely honest I'm not too shabby about the names I think they're they're all right uh, I think if it go, I think once I understand the story a bit more of what the area will entice in terms of the story of the whole themed land and the story of the roller coasters um, I feel like I'll understand the names a lot more once I understand the story a bit more um, now, the idea of dueling roller coasters. Now, imagine, could you imagine if it was dueling extreme spinning coasters? I mean, <laughs> that would be wicked. That would be wicked. But I don't think we're looking at that. I think we're looking at dueling coasters, traditional dueling roller coasters. Um, and if you think about it, um, I guess the... I guess the last sort of coaster that Europa Park added was kids slash family. So I'd like to see some thrilling dueling coasters if it is going to be a dueling coaster. Um, unless maybe one of them's for the coaster and one of them's for a flat ride of some sort themed to transferring or apparatus or something like that. So I think one could be a flat ride, one could be a coaster, or both of them could be the roller coasters. So, we could look at dueling coasters, or we could look at one coaster and a flat ride. And a flat ride would be a good supporting act for the main show, which is the coaster. So, there's a million different questions to get from this, but, you know... They've done this in the past, working with the adventure stories and, you know, tying it in with new attractions. Rulantica, Voltarium, the new Pirates of Batavia. This new novel is set to be released in the autumn, set in Croatia. That could give away some clues that Croatia will be the land for 2023, not Romania. But I do see Romania coming to the part. Don't think because Croatia looks like it's going to be the new area for 2023. Don't think that Romania is completely out of the question just yet. Don't think like that because I think it could still happen uh, somewhere else in the park. But um, I think Croatia will be a wonderful, wonderful land for the park. So fair play to the park for doing that. And, um, you know, I think we can get it pretty nailed on now that Croatia will be the land for 2023, in my opinion. I think that's just uh, what I see negotiation wise. Uh, but there we go, guys. Thank you very, very much for checking out this theme park newsroom update coming from Europa Park in Rus, Germany. My name is Coast Chell, Coop, living the coast life, and I'll see you guys next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a Europa-tastic day. We'll get more in the future.